folks welcome back we are out in black bay like always it's either halfway or black bay i should stop saying it now we just got off the lake one sleigh today new fishermen can't keep them all we're gonna go for a ride uh probably two kilometers back here maybe even less there's a lake there's a portage just in the bay here. So I'm going to change my gear and we'll hop on the sled. First, we need some wood. My brother is grabbing water right now. And uh, I'll take care of the wood job. I got Steven. Yeah. Yeah. He beat us to it. He has traps over there. That's the portage going to the cabin and there's another one here that goes inside the real black bay black bay is over here we call that over there black bay because it's just a bay over so there's two portages coming to this lake we went for a ride that way looking around we brought the 410 22 top and bottom as both so uh yeah we'll go look for some petarmigans. Maybe we'll switch it up and eat a chicken for a supper. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. We just stopped on this island here. There's an old ice shack. The boys always talk about this. There's a few of them around the lake. Way back when, I don't know, I probably, I was probably in Pampers or wasn't even around. They used to do summer fish, commercial fishing, and these shacks here would be filled with ice to keep the fish cool and not go to waste. We're just trying to get up here, it's so bushy, and I'll give you guys a look at it. I guess we have to go this way. We didn't find a door yet, we went around pretty much. Okay, there's a door over there, we walked right by it. Oh, there's the door right here. There's another one over there. We were looking for a big massive door. And here these are. Can we squeeze? Oh, that's why there's two doors. There's two sections. Nice. From a overview, you don't know how many times I've drove by here and never noticed it. If you're not looking for it, you'll drive right by it. Another day of this shit. She's blowy. Right now it's not so bad. We're in a shelter on this island. We're just heading to halfway. I have to go drop off Trap's food before he starves. My brother stayed behind there in Black Bay. He's uh, warming up the house. I think he is going to go get a load of wood. And as for us, I don't know. If it's like this tomorrow, we have no choice but to come out here. We have to look at our nets. It'll be a few days tomorrow. Thank God my dad and the boys had a look at them. We couldn't come out here. 
what they did uh, when we were out in Black Bay there, looking at those 10. There's another dog out here too. Since last week, I think, my dad picked him up. He's been staying out at this cabin all alone for probably over a month now. So my dad went to go pick him up. They were fishing around there and he heard a dog cry. He's been there for a while, no one taking care of him. I don't even know how he survived. Wolves are uh, running around in front of the cabin. Trap can't even go beside him or he tries to bite him. He's been alone for a while, so he has to get used to him. You don't like trap, do you? Down. Well, there's our birds. Hopefully we could take at least two. I'm trying to keep the camera out of the wind. We're in here looking for those birds. It looks like something had a meal here. Here's one, and there's another one. Okay, that's probably the same one. Is it? Most likely. Something took that down. Where did he go? That's how camouflaged these birds are. I was about to grab him. I guess he wasn't dead and I thought I'll come around here and he took off. Took my eyes off him for one second and he disappeared. He can't fly, he's running around. One. Two. Three. That right there is redemption. I drove past these ptarmigans driving inside this little trail here. I was going in there to turn around. I stopped and my buddy here says, you didn't see those? So we came walking back probably 20 yards and here they were. I was busy looking at the trail. But we have three, around 10 more just flew up from here. So that's good. I didn't think we were gonna see any we're in the bay here at the cabin. This is where that portage is. The cabin's just right there.
is eating. All the willows. I'll pick these up. Or just throw them in there. This guy could come with us. We have a trap right here. Trout, that old bird. Some fresh guts down there. I'll even throw this there, I guess. We have a canal bait. Six slabs should be enough for me and, well probably not, we're probably gonna have to get like three more for him. This is just an appetizer for him. I don't know, I just woke up from a little nap, it's a little dark, but you guys silly? I'm still gonna send it. <laughs> <laughs> this guy needs a sponsorship 2020 x games freestyle we're out uh i don't even know where we are we've been cruising uh muskegs for who knows how long looking for moose there's a lot of tracks everywhere we go there's some fresh ones on the outside here and inside over here somewhat old but they're around there's a lot of moose now we're just not seeing them the old girl here needs some oil so we stopped and gave her a break working hard pulling this toboggan in this deep snow The ptarmigan. Come on. Burner is a little high. Rice and ptarmigan in a soft shell. That is right on. Brandon's been sitting here for 10 minutes. There's already 12 cans of pop. 